Hello everybody! Welcome again to a new Do It Yourself at Home Nail Art! <laughs> Hello everybody! I hope everybody is doing well and uh, yeah, let's see the set that I created today with my Ebony Plus Creations acrylics. Let me tell you, I am really proud what I did with this set. You probably have seen it in the thumbnail, but yeah, let's see what we're gonna use. So I'm gonna use just a little bit blue eyes. I'm gonna switch it up to the white though. We're gonna use blue tang from Ebony Plush Nail Creation as well as her amazing clear acrylic and let me tell you you will see it at the end her clear is like the bomb okay yeah if you love acrylic girl you need that clear in your life <laughs> i'm not kidding so i am starting off with a blue tang by the way i don't know if you have uh, seen the previous video that i did with this color but this color is glow in the dark. Say what? <laughs> so yeah, you will also see that at the end. And let me tell you, the glow in this one is like fabulous. Okay, so let me just tell you guys, I am pretty new in doing marbles with acrylic. So please give me a break. I know I'm not doing it the way I'm supposed to do it, but I'm trying. Like... A big thank you to my sweet, sweet, sweet sister, Dunya. Oh my gosh, guys. Can I just ask you also, like, to to pray for her and her family? Because her mom, yeah, she is really, really not doing well. She still is in, um, she is still in the hospital. Um, she, yeah, she cannot breathe by herself and stuff. And... Hard decisions are gonna be possible be needed in this situation. So please, guys, if you can do like a little prayer, if you can, for her. But okay, so a huge, huge thank you to my sis because she is actually doing so hard her best teaching me how to marble with acrylic. So she also told me, sis, you need to do the figure eight with your brush. And you see me doing that right there. See, I'm trying, sis. I'm trying. <laughs> so, yeah, I hope she also going to love this video because I know that she really, really love a good marble nail. So, sis, I did two marble nails in this set, okay? <laughs> okay. So, uh, like you probably already can see, this nail is going to be a full cover marble nail with the blue tang, a little bit ice blue and white. Um, a little bit more at the end, you will see that I'm also going to come in with uh, a beautiful glittery acrylic from Model Ones. Just to put a little bit spark in my marble, see you know what I mean? But hey, I did not bad, right? Yeah, I really, really like the result of this nail. Look at that. Right? Right. So, yeah. Like you can see, I am faffing a lot on this nail. I am so sorry. <laughs> By the way, I also uh, like to say a big, big thank you to Crafty Fox. Because the brush that I'm using to do those marbles, she sent them to me. I don't know if you remember that unboxing, but... Have you seen that marble? Ooh, ooh. <laughs> so yeah, my sweet April, thank you so, so much. By the way, if you don't know it, guys, but April, she has a store because she is making her own, um, not acrylics. Why do I want to say acrylics? It's not acrylics. It's uh, resin, resin pieces. And she also is selling a lot of crafting and nail products. So yeah. Definitely, definitely go and check out her store as well. I know you're going to love it. Like, just look at this little brush, right? I believe it comes in a set from four brushes, all different sizes. And let me tell you, they are great to work with acrylic, like you can see. It's not losing his shape. I never had acrylic stuck in the bristles. Yeah, these are like a perfect 
if you ask me, like to do 3D with it, 3D work with acrylic. Because like you can see, the shape is really, really holding on. Okay, so let's talk a little bit about this nail. Like you can see, I am not covering the cuticle area with my marble. I am only applying the marble in the middle. I'm uh, going to leave the tip clear, but at the cuticle area, I'm uh, going to come in with my beautiful beacon nude color, also from Ebony Plus Creations. Yeah, you already have seen it in the title, right? All my acrylics that I'm using are from Sweet Ebony Plus Creations. So what are you waiting for? Go, go, go. Go and see her shop because she has a lot more than acrylics in her web shop. Let me just tell you. Oh my gosh. You probably have seen my haul that I did, right? Mm -hmm. Those cute, beautiful beautiful bears and stuff yeah you can have them too okay so i see we already are busy with nail number three i basically doing the same like i did with number two the only difference is i'm not doing a marble i'm only using the blue tang and yeah just like nail number two i'm only gonna apply that in the middle of the nail see by the way <laughs> Yeah, yeah. I don't. I don't think you really see it with this nail. I think it's with the next nail. But yeah, you're gonna see me really, really struggle with the acrylic uh, because I was re working with the tip of my brush. So every time when I was trying to smooth out my acrylic, I was like taking away the acrylic. You will see it in a little bit. Okay. Yeah, I think it's this nail. <laughs> so again, guys. Yeah, I'm. I'm. I'm still learning with acrylic okay so yeah finally i discovered how to use the belly of the brush <laughs> see how i'm taking away the acrylic instead of like flattening it out there we go there we go there we go do you see how i use the belly oh my gosh it was like the world going open for me oh i was so happy finally finally i figured out how to use the belly of the brush because let me tell you guys it sounds really easy when people say that in their videos, but yeah, if you want to try it yourself, it's not that easy to figure out what they mean by using the belly. I know they're trying to tell you to use the flat piece of the brush, but they're not basically telling you that you really need to lay your brush flat on the nail. You know what I mean? Look, see what I'm doing? My brush is like a parallel with the nail. So if there are people watching this video that are new with acrylic and also struggling with that issue, taking away the acrylic instead of smoothing it out, try and lay your brush flat so you can really use the belly of your brush, okay? Yeah, that's my biggest advice in this video, I guess. Just look at the result, right? Let me tell you, I already played a lot with acrylic, but never ever I was able to get the result that I had, like in this video. Just look at that. I have no bumps, no lumps. I'm not changing the shape of my nail at all, because, yeah, that's also a problem that I always had. Let me tell you, I filed a lot when I did acrylic nails in the past. <laughs> A lot. Yeah, if you are following me for quite some time, then you know how my nails were looking, right? Before filing. So, I really hope you can see the difference with the video today and my older videos. <laughs> because I think it's like a huge difference. Okay, I know, I know, my bead was way too wet right here with the beautiful pecan. <laughs> But yeah, you know, like I just told you, I'm also still learning with acrylic. So yeah, you need to allow yourself to make mistakes, you know what I mean? So I am not the type like to hide away my mistakes or like to cut them out. I know there are some channels that are doing that. No blame to them though, you know, I just like to be like transparent to you guys, also filming my mistakes. Because that's how you learn, right? Ooh, here is the model one. So look at that beautiful glitter, right? So I just gonna use an eeny teeny tiny bit on the two marble nails. So like you can see, I take a little bit of the blue tang and a little bit of that glitter acrylic and marble them over my nails. So 
I also go over the nude part, the pecan part, just a little bit with the glitter. And uh, yeah, because you can see my blend was not really like it was supposed to be on this nail. So I will come in with my blue tang and I don't know if I also used the white, we will see. But yeah, I gonna smooth out the, uh, the fade. The, see, now I'm coming in with pecan again and I think I also come in with the blue tang. Like to really make the fate better looking. I hope I say that correct because I'm not English number one here, okay? <laughs> oh, I really hope you liked the video already till now, guys. Because, yeah, I know it is a long video today. It's like 35 minutes. I'm so sorry. Let me tell you, I really did my best to shorten the video as much as possible. But, you know, it's hard because you also don't want to leave out, like, important parts, if you know what I mean. Like, it's hard if you want to recreate a nail that somebody did that you have seen in a video. And you are not receiving, like, all the information how they made it, you know what I mean? So, yeah. I did speed it up, like you can see, just a little tiny bit. I believe uh, my acrylic part, I speed up 1.5, so it's really not a lot, but... Yeah, in time, it really does. It really, it really is a lot in time. If you, uh, you know, if you put it all together, if you know what I mean. Okay, so on this nail, I also gonna come in with the beautiful pecan. And like you can see, I'm doing a fade again. Oh my god, let me tell you. I am so, so proud on that side. I know I already told you. I did, I did. But yeah, I am so proud to the end result. Oh, by the way, by the way, I cannot forget to mention. But if you look in the left corner right there, you can see a 15% discount code for when you go to shop with Ebony Plus Creations. So yeah, definitely don't forget to use it. Don't forget to use it, okay? You can save you some money, some coins, if you use it. <laughs> okay, so there is the full marble nail. How beautiful is she, right? Okay, it's decoration time. So I believe I have the big purpley pink snowflakes also from Ebony Plus Creations. I'm not sure though. What I know for sure is that the holographic gray stars, those I have from Divine Sparkly Creations. And let me tell you, that girl have a bunch of colors and you can get them all, okay? They're gorgeous. Okay, so let's use the beautiful clear from Ebony Plus Creations. I know I did it a little bit too quick, see? My star was not set yet, so it moved around just a little bit, but it's not a big deal though. I work around it, see? Just smush it back in there, and there we go. And guys, let me tell you, if you are looking after like a fabulous clear acrylic, then you just need to get you this one, okay? Let me tell you, this one, it's clear just like jealous i'm not kidding you you will see it at the end because i also include a little clip where i go over a gel liner so you can see the writings and like the green lines on the bottle through my nail okay i'm not kidding you that clear is so clear oh gosh you just yeah you just need it in your life so definitely go and check it out on Ebony Plus Creations, okay? Because you're going to feel sorry if you don't. <laughs> yeah, I'm serious, guys. You, you really, you're really going to be missing out if you just don't, don't try it, okay? Uh, so yeah. I don't know what else to say, guys. Like I told you already, it's like a long video and I'm getting out of words. But how are you guys doing? I hope everybody is doing well. Okay, I don't really know what else to say for now. So yeah, I think I'm gonna let you enjoy a little bit of the video, just with the music. And uh, I will return back if I feel that I need to come back, okay? Speak to you in a little bit. <laughs>
Okay, I'm jumping back in. Like you can see, I am encapsulating all the nails with the beautiful clear from Ebony Plush Creations. Oh my god, I freaking love that clear. <laughs> So, uh, the filing, I will do that off screen, guys, just to save some time in the video because I already told you this video is already taking up 35 minutes. So, can you imagine how long the video would take if I would leave in the filing? So, look how beautiful they already look before filing. So, let's do that and uh, yeah, you will see me back in a second. There we go. Are you ready? 3, 2, 1, bam! Wow, the magic of editing, all filed. What do you think? Oh my God, they are so beautiful, right? Okay, so we're gonna work with some gypsum glue gel today. That is that awkward gel. Um, yeah, it's it's marvelous though. Okay, B or C nails. Do you see her Instagram? Don't use it. Okay, she is hacked. You don't don't want to go on that account. Uh, I also showing you her web shop and definitely go and pay her a visit because wow Do you see the, the box right here? That is all from her. Okay, she have a marvelous product So we're gonna use a snowman in this set. So here is the gypsum gel We also gonna use the she modern glitter to sugar the gypsum gel Do you see how strange it looks? It really really reminds me like plaster you know the plaster that you put on walls like to stuff in the holes that you make in the walls you know what I mean that's really what it looks like in the jar so the first nail I left in real time for you guys so you can see how long it actually takes me to do that nail because let me tell you how beautiful the end result is on the nails that is also how much time it takes to apply it you know what i mean it is it really really has like a mind of its own it's not that easy to apply you really need to pay a lot of focus on it you know so it goes where you want it to go i hope you can see it in the video but do you see how thick it is and like how clumpy some parts are do you see that clump right there so yeah you need to take it off and then i just place it on another area on the nail basically so here i place it in the cuticle so let me tell you also like the cuticle area yeah she was hard to do with the gypsum but oh my gosh wait till you will see the end result because it really looks like actual snow it's wow really <laughs> it is such a beautiful gel to work with it is a little bit of a learning curve uh, to work with it but once you are used to it let me tell you guys you're gonna freaking love it like i don't know if you guys have seen the video when i just got the gypsum gel because i have it in six colors i believe um i already did like a video where i did some uh, designs with it one design was a beautiful ice cone oh my gosh it was it was so realistic looking just with the structure you know what i mean like the brown that it comes in with it really really looks so much like a cookie color you know so that's what i used for my ice cone cookie and then also for the ice cream itself like if you use the pink Oh, it really looks like strawberry ice cream. I am not kidding you. I will see if I can link that video in my info box or maybe in the i cards um, on the top of this video. Yeah, I will see if I can find it to place it in my i cards. Uh, but I definitely gonna do my best to place it in my info box. So if you have missed out on that video, it's I really, really, definitely recommend that uh, that video. Like, yeah, I also made like a ribbon with that uh, gypsum gel. Let me think. I also did a flower. I think I did like four or even five designs with all the colors. So yeah, if you want to learn more about this gypsum gel, I really, really recommend you to watch that one video. So I also going to cover the bottom on this nail because this is the nail that I going to um, attach the snowman on. So I want my snowman something to stand on, you know, I don't want him to just float on the nail. You know what I mean? So yeah, you will see I am like 
creating like a little bit snow humps and bumps at the bottom. <laughs> you know what I mean, right? <laughs> if you don't know what I mean, you will see it in a second, okay? <laughs> but I am so, so happy that I used this challenge as set. I, I am not kidding, guys. I am not kidding. I know at the end the only downfall, if you do it the way like I'm using it right here on the borders, the only downfall that you have on the end is your nails are not gonna look like, how can I say it, that neat anymore on the edges because it's really bumpy and lumpy, you know what I mean? You also don't want to file it away because it's gonna take away from the snow look, so yeah. I just, that's the reason why why I left it like that. It's not too bad though. I think like if you are not like a real nail expert, I don't think you're even gonna notice it to be say. You know what I mean? But do you see how long it takes me to just do that one nail? I don't know how many minutes that I'm already working on it. But yeah, this is a really like the real time that you're seeing right here i promise you guys when i gonna do the second nail i promise you i will speed it up okay <laughs> i did leave it in though because on the other nails i'm doing um like can i call it ice crystals coming down i don't think because it's snow is that existing like snow snow icicles or something <laughs> It would not exist yet. Well, we just discovered it. <laughs> you know what I mean? But let me let me tell you. Yeah, those snow icicle thingamabobbies at the end are looking really, really neat. Let me tell you. Wow, I really, really love them so much. <laughs> okay. Um, what else can we tell you in this video? Okay, so, uh, like you will see... After I cured the snow on this nail, I'm gonna give it the nail a beautiful high shine top coat with my She Modern top coat. That is a new product. By the way, I am also her ambassador, so don't forget to use my discount code. You can save 10% on your order when you order on the website and also only when you live in the US, okay? She is only shipping out in the US, but you can save yourself 10%, okay? Just use my code Sassy Lovers, okay? So here we are with the She Modern the glitter it's like a rainbow holographic glitter oh, it's so beautiful <laughs> and here is my nail so I gonna bake her in the oven for one minute oh I'm not coming in with the top coat okay so yeah top coat moment is I guess gonna come after I'm done with this nail I guess I don't know you know what I gonna shut up and let you enjoy this moment <laughs> you will see when I gonna pop in back again okay <laughs> oh my gosh do you see how beautiful this looks ah uh, and I'm even not finished yet Oh my gosh, I really, really love that nail. Okay, guys. Okay, I'm gonna stop rambling. And yeah, you will see when I'm gonna pop in again, okay? Okay, I'm back guys. Okay, be brushing off all the excess glitter and oh my gosh, look at that. Beautiful, right? Ooh. Okay, so now we're gonna use the new Jelly Clear No Wipe Top Coat from She Modern. Oh my god, are you ready? Are you ready? Look how the stars come to life and the snowflakes. Oh my gosh, I love top coating time, don't you? <laughs> Look how gorgeous this nail becomes. 
Oh my gosh, I freaking love it. I freaking freaking love it. <laughs> Do you see how carefully I'm going so I'm not covering the gypsum? I'm gonna let you know a little secret because yeah, I went back in with my top coat and I did cover uh, the, all the snow bits, okay? <laughs> Yeah, I don't know why, but yeah, I just did. Oh my gosh, look at that. Do you see the beautiful Model 1 glitter shining through now? See, that's why I did them glossy. I was so tempted to keep them like matte because I really love them matte. But yeah, I was missing my sparkle. So, okay, I am attaching the BRC nail uh, snowman just in the top coat. But I do recommend though, if you do that on a real human, just use like um, a gem gel or like a nail glue otherwise i promise you the snowman is not gonna uh, stay on the nails if you just using top coat okay but oh my gosh have you seen that nail she was so gorgeous right that snowman is so freaking cute let me tell you brc she really don't ask a lot of money for her product so definitely definitely go and visit her shop okay Okay, so you see me holding those nails together, right? That is just to make sure that I'm lining out the snow icicles correctly on this nail. Because even though the nails are not going to lay next to each other, I still want them to look, yeah, similar the, the best I can. You know what I mean? Yeah, you know what I mean, right? English number one! <laughs> Um, so yeah, wow, we already are on 28, almost 29 minutes in the video. That means that the video is almost done, guys. So yeah, I think that is the last nail that I am showing you with the gypsum and with the shimodon glitter. And I think the next part that you will see is me using the matte top coat from shimodon. See? Told you, told you. No, it's not the matte. Oh, it's still the high gloss. I'm sorry. Let's bring this nails to life. And oh my god, look at the clear part. Okay, are you ready? Are you ready to be amazed? Oh my gosh, I freaking love that clear acrylic. Ah, oh, look at that. And look at the beautiful holographic snowflakes and stars coming to life. Are you freaking kidding me? Oh, I love those nails so much. <laughs> I really hope you love them too, guys. I really hope that. Mm -mm -mm. So yeah, to make the tip even more clear, I'm also gonna give a top coat underneath of the nail, just like that. Oh my gosh, look at that. That is real nail porn right there, baby. Mm -mm. Oh, look at that right okay so um we're gonna give that a little cure do you see that come on really <laughs> just look at that okay so now i'm gonna give this nail also a high gloss top coat look at that mm -mm -mm. That is so yummy, isn't it? Mm-mm. Look at the holographic come to life again. So yeah, of course we're also going to do that underneath because we also have a clear part on that nail. Oh, look how cute the snowman is on top of that one nail, right? Ah, she really completes the set, let me tell you. Okay, now we're going to come in with my jelly mat. I know it's not available for the moment with she modern i hope she's gonna bring it back because yeah her mat is the bomb you will see it in a sec so yeah it's crystal time so i'm applying my uh, divine sparkly creation crystals in the matte top coat we're gonna give it a nice uh, bake in my oven oh my gosh do you see the little twinkle in there Ooh, yeah, I decided on this nail, it was a little bit too plain, so that's why I decided to make a huge snowflake. Not just a snowflake, uh-uh, we're gonna make her sparkly in a second. So this is the first time that I'm trying out to make a snowflake that way, because I see it, like, on every channel. And oh my gosh, this snowflake is such a life changer. I was never able to make a decent snowflake, but 
Look at that! Say what? Ah, so beautiful, right? Okay, coming in with my divine sparkly creation crystals because we're gonna make that beach sparkle. Uh -huh. <laughs> I'm sorry for my language. I don't know why I was saying that, but yeah. Oh my God, I am so excited about this one. Just look at her, right? Ah, oh, so, so, so gorgeous. Look at the sparkle, guys. Isn't she gorgeous? So yeah, I really think that nail really needed that snowflake on top of it. Because it really was for me, yeah, it was like my set was not done yet. You know, this nail really was way too plain. So yeah, look at that. So here are all the nails all done. What do you think, guys? Is it a sassy or a trashy for you? Let me know. And also let me know, do you love the set a more with the extra nail art or without because i had a hard time deciding if i would just leave it the way it was a matte set without the nail art or doing the nail art so yeah definitely definitely let me know guys what do you prefer nail art or without a matte or glossy i cannot wait to see your answers in the comments guys oh my gosh look at that Gorgeous, right? Okay, I see. I'm gonna leave you guys, but you will still see the glow in the dark part because let me tell you, the glow is like, ah, oh, to die for. So I'm gonna leave you like I always do. I hope you're gonna do it together with me. Give these a big kiss and bro. Rawr! And stay as sassy. Bye bye, everybody. I love you all and I see you later. Mwah! Oh my gosh, look how clear that tip is, right? Ebony Plus Creations Clear Rocks Girl. Okay, ready for the glow in the dark? 3, 2, 1. Bam! Say so what? <laughs> you see what I mean? Oh my gosh, I love the set even more if you see it in the dark. Just look at that. Are you freaking kidding me? It's like a night sky and you still see the snowman. Ah. I'm so in love with that. Okay, now I really need to go, guys, because my video is really going to the end. Speak to you all later. Bye-bye. <laughs>